Goblin. You should totally add it to your game. No, I'm not adding goblins to my game. Uh, I don't see why you won't. Because it's a sci-fi game. Why would there be goblins? That's genre mixing. But mixing genres is cool. Plus, you can totally make them futuristic. Fine. I'll think about it. You're not gonna add goblins, are you? <laughs> you know me so well. <laughs> Danny, I gotta go. I can't there's someone outside my apartment getting mad. Harley, just call the police. They won't get here in time. Harley! You make this too easy, my friend. But now I have the upper hand. Simpson, Alana, we have an issue. I actually got it right. Way too much Moltronium just running through your system that we have to have monitored before we can just let you go home. Moltronium? It's a synthetic chemical element. It alters your DNA and it makes you immune to literally everything. Okay, so another question. Why did you put it in my body? Okay, you got shot with a bullet that was meant to incapacitate anybody who had Miltronium just running through their system. But since you didn't have it in your system, it would have killed you. I had to alter your DNA so that you would live. But we aren't sure whether or not your body will reject it. We've only done this once, and that was with Kaysen. Kaysen? Me? You met me as Glaciator. So what, you're like some sort of superhero or something? Um. Yeah, something like that. Okay. So, what you're saying is I was shot with this chemically enhanced bullet that would have killed me unless you added some weird substance to my DNA so I could fight it? Yes, exactly. So am I supposed to have superpowers now or something? We are positive. We won't know for a few days. For your safety though, we need to keep you here to monitor your vitals and make sure that the body is going to accept the Miltronium. What happens if it doesn't? Then you die. Well, aren't you a ray of sarcastic sunshine? Look, believe us or don't, we're just trying to keep you safe. You saved our brother's life. Even if he is a huge pain in the butt, I'm glad he's alive. I couldn't just let someone get robbed or 
whatever was happening that night in the alley. I was getting my butt kicked by one of Maddox's lackeys. Maddox? Jordan Maddox? Multi-billionaire CEO of MaxBite? <laughs> the leading company in gaming. You know who Jordan Maddox is? I'm studying to become a video game designer. I obviously know who she is. Well, her company has been advertising their new product. Yeah, the, the Glorix 5600. It's supposed to be this new innovation in VR tech. But it's not what everyone thinks it's going to be. That's why she's been after Kaysen. I'm not following. Mad X is creating weapons in the form of VR tech. That's why I was fighting her minion in the alley. She's been trying to get to the source of my powers for like years now. Why is she concerned with how you got your powers? Because she wants to make an army of like super soldiers. This VR game, it's a death trap. Once she finds out the physical properties of Miltronium, she'll become unstoppable. So what do I do? Nothing. Nothing? Okay, so let me get this straight. You saved my life with this Miltronium thing, altering my DNA, giving me the possibility of having supernatural powers, and you want me to sit on the sidelines and do nothing. You're not joining us. You stay here until we know you're not gonna die, and then you go home. You're not a hero. But I could be. I this isn't a video game. Even if you do have powers, you won't know how to use them. So teach me. Guys, we don't even know if she has powers yet. Why would you even want this life? It's not as uh, glamorous as the movies or the games. You've been missing for days and no one's heard from you until now. What have you been doing? It's complicated, Danny. Your dad has been worried sick. Your brother hung up posters of you like you're some missing pet. I'm surprised the police aren't here asking questions. Okay, calm down. I'm okay. I'm sorry. It's just... I thought you were dead. Who are you? Arnie. Jordan Maddox. Don't, don't play dumb. You know my name. Mad X. Mad X? Harley, what is going on? Stand back from me. She's dangerous. Is that what Glaciator told you? He is a smart guy after all, but he's an idiot for letting you go. What do you want? Oh, only the information I've been looking for for years. How you got your powers. I to burst your bubble, but I don't have any powers. You can't fool me. You should be dead because of the bullet I created. This is no use. This lackey can't. What's in Glaciator is in you. Harley, what the heck is she talking about? Danny, I love you, but you need to shut up. Oh, I'll take care of that. <laughs> oh, that just made him louder. Why the heck would you do that? Don't worry, it's a regular bullet. I didn't come here to kill you. I came to talk. Why would I talk to you? You just shot my boyfriend. Back to our conversation. I know you have powers. Again, I don't. Are you sure? You don't feel your veins going icy cold? Wanting to destroy everything in sight? You don't feel any of that. Maybe I am wrong. 
Maybe you are worthless. Or maybe you just need to be loved. Don't you dare hurt him. Or what? Too late, Glaciator. Oh, yeah, of course I am. You're still here and... Oh, you haven't escaped? Huh, whatever shall I do? We have to stop meeting like this. <laughs> um, Jensen, can you come pick up the boyfriend? You're awake. What happened, Crystal? You went head to head with Mad X. Uh, Danny's okay. Uh, luckily, the bullet wasn't chemically enhanced this time. Jensen patched him up and sent him home. He's not going to remember anything. Okay. So, I have powers. Looks like it. You figured out one power. There should be more. It, it took Kaysen some time to figure out all of his. But we're all here to help. Now we just gotta come up with the alias for you. But that can come later. You should go get some rest. We'll talk more in the morning. Yeah. I have a lot to think about. She's got a long road ahead of her. But she has us. We'll all figure this out. For now, I think we can call it a night. Agreed. Kason? Uh, yeah, you guys go ahead. I just type some stuff I need to work on. Wanted. She has her powers. Now, give me your end of the deal. This isn't what we agreed on. There's still more to do. That wasn't our deal. You broke a promise before. Now it's my turn. You finish the job, and you get the reward. 